You can literally make any selection, any free selection at all. Say, for example, this card. So all we have to do now is just take this uh, card, take this card, find a, uh, like I said, just uh, find a nice pile here, slip it right inside the deck. But you see what's funny is that even with that, and putting it right inside the middle here, please hit the up button again. Number one always seems to come back. And ladies and gentlemen, in three, two, one. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you penetrate a door. <sighs> and now for you kiddies in the audience, a little history lesson. This man is Winston Churchill. He was Prime Minister of Great Britain from 1939 to 1945. He was one, uh, a major help in helping the Allies win the war, um, specifically World War II. He was also a figure of inspiration to millions of people. He visited Halifax uh, during the war as uh, part of a uh, morale uh, raising here in Canada. And uh, we're going to use Mr. Uh, Churchill to uh, help uh, raise uh, morale right here, in a way. This is an ordinary piece of rope. As you can see, it swings relatively easily. Yet with Mr. Churchill's help, we're going to get it to stand to attention. And with any luck, we can use the inspiration he raised to raise it like the hopes were raised during World War II. And at the snap of a command, it drops back to normal again. So thank you, Mr. Churchill, for inspiring this rope. Thanks, for, uh, Mr. Churchill, for inspiring the rope, just like you did inspire those of our ancestors. You, sir, up here! In order to verify whether or not he was lying, I had to calibrate myself to his very thought processes. So I used the classic card routine, figuring not only that I could use fortune telling to not only read his mind for a card, but also tell what the card meant. I took away the jokers. I got him to freely select any card he wanted. Not show it to me, but by simply taking a look at it, showing it to the audience. I was able to tell that his card was a red card. It was a complete, even balance of all five points. This man must be a wicked, for I sensed it was the five of diamonds, the pentacle. <laughs>